Hello and welcome back to yet another video from Matty YouTube and in today's video before I start I don't support Tottenham um so so uh, relax um because I know half of you who clicked on the video and I like, didn't even know like what like saw what this was about I was like oh my gosh this looks so interesting Vinland Saga is such a go-to anime even though it's not shown and it's actually a seinen uh let me see what he's talking about and then you see this guy's rocking a Tottenham t-shirt actually I'm gonna change it because you know my gut salty or something like that no better <laughs> So <laughs> I talk about um, movie reviews sometimes, or like series reviews, and this time I'm going to be talking about an an anime that I absolutely loved the first season of. Like when after I finished watching that that first season of of Villain Saga, I was left in absolute awe, and then I was waiting. Oh, it's rather let me buy the manga, but you know, like every uh, every volume of Villain Saga is like twenty pounds, so you know, mm, it's not very smart. So I was like, let me wait for season two, and hopefully, unlike A Promised Neverland, they don't absolutely mess up such a good series. So I watched season one, I think like two days ago, and the ending was so beautiful, bro. I, I, I loved the ending of the episode, and when Netflix announced season two comes out um, on Monday, I'm like, oh, season two, like season two, season two? And then I watched, and, and then I, I clicked on Netflix and I was like, season two episode one, oh, okay, it's there. And then I saw January 31st, season two episode two. What? And then I scrolled down to season two episode like 11 or episode 10, coming out July. Just, just why? It just ruined my day. Like, it was a Monday as well, like a Monday, a beautiful Monday. Sorry if I'm like, you know, deviating a little bit, but I just wanted to talk to you about this. I was so happy on that day. It was like season two, like the entirety of season two coming out in one day. And then, and then I saw one episode. And I was like, I was so confused. And I was like, where did the rest go? And then I, I scroll down and I, I find out it comes out in July, a couple months later. That was just depressing. It, I, like my day was going so well as well. I was like, I'm gonna get home and watch season, like Vinland Saga season two episode one, home, <laughs> and then I get back and like, this is just this is one episode. Like, but that's besides the point. And with this one episode, I will touch on every single episode of season two when it comes out. A couple of days after it comes out. Th this is coming out like maybe I don't know a week after the first episode com has come out. Um, maybe a week or two. But even so, I will touch on every episode, not on the day it comes out, but eventually, and uh, that is a promise. But I'm not gonna, you know, specify when exactly. Um, yeah, but let's start off with the first episode. So we see this this guy, this random guy that we don't know who he is at all. This isn't Thorfinn. What happened to Thorfinn? And we see him walk around a a beautiful landscape, a farm. Yeah, a farmland that's been rebuilt after an invasion. He goes down, sits with his sister and his mum, and they have a nice time. They they talk. Um, he's obviously he's like doing all the manly stuff. He's cutting down trees. He's doing all sorts of stuff. And we cut a little bit later, where there's a bit of an well, not a bit. This is this is an invasion, and that land has been built up from an invasion and now just for it to be invaded again um while the mum the sister and the man that we still don't know their name is running away the mum gets shot which i'm not gonna lie is was pretty emotional but i saw that from a mile away i genuinely thought when i saw that there's an invasion uh, or they're invading from the invaders. They're invading. Jesus Christ! They're invading from what? Escaping? Sorry, uh, am I? In, uh, I'm, I'm just not here today. Um, I'm trying to escape from the invaders. They're trying to run away or like abandon their um, newly rebuilt farm land, I guess. Um, to escape the invaders, g go off to another land to escape these invaders now the mum gets shot it's an emotional scene for both of them for both the sister and the brother the mum makes the brother promise to protect the sister and just a two minutes later which is i didn't i knew the mum was gonna pass away i knew that 
but I didn't expect the sister to pass away and uh, the couple you know NPC thugs like <laughs> a couple um, back on counter thugs come around and then they see these two people who have just lost their mum uh, the mum gets shot by an arrow they, they've just lost their mum at that moment and they're completely defenseless they can't do anything in the moment so the brother's sister gets captured and is you know she, she's squealing she's she, I mean they're obviously you know first of all it's sustaining okay uh, berserk is in this category and if you've seen berserk you, you, you know what 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 could potentially happen plus th this is literally an anime about vikings which are basically bar barbarians S so if you really deep it so anything can happen to a woman uh in this era uh i'll let your imagination run wild with that sort of explanation and i don't want to you know g you know get into anything explicit because you know <laughs> youtube so um i'll just let your imagination run wild with that you know so she takes her hairpin and she stabs the guy in the back you know self-defense and then with that you know there's a bit of swearing because you know it's the same it's the same and then she gets killed so now this guy has lost his mother and his sister and then he gets sold into slavery all in one day he gets put on a boat where people fall ill when people fall ill they throw them off the boat so that no one else can fall ill they check their tongues if that if they've fallen sick and then this guy he gets to a, who, to a land people are buying him people have come from other lands to buy him and then we see a character from season one a friend of Thor's the troll of Nam a friend of Thor the troll of Nam and it's the first character that we've seen in season one and season two he was brought to our new main character and he exclaims this isn't Thorfinn Thorfinn is scrawny with a blonde hair and that's the first time that we see him in the season so obviously he's not dead which is a good news I guess um and we're gonna have to see Thorfinn because you know first of all it's the first episode this is still villain saga but the way uh, I really wish they introduced him for a little bit more than five seconds but I'll get to that later then he finally gets bought to a person who's gonna he's gonna work in that person's land also first of all he tries to escape but that's pretty irrelevant because they bring him back so and then we we see the land he accepts his fate as a slave and then he's met or he meets the person he's going to be working with in the farm and Thorfinn arrives <sighs> what a great cap off to the first episode and I've just like summarized 24 minutes for nine in nine minutes actually in less than nine minutes because I spent the first four minutes talking about my you know mon Monday depression <laughs> but um yeah that was the first episode it was such a thrilling episode i loved it so much i give it a solid 8.5 mm, 8.9 8 out of 10. It could have been introduced like for more than five seconds because we finally see him he's all grown up thorfinn he's also now been sold as a slave yeah so we're like what's to come of these two i've heard a bit about you know for the, from the people who read the manga that season two is nothing like season one so it does not as much violence but i can touch on the philosophy of season one that is something that that is something possible i'm not going to do a, a season recap of season one because first of all i loved it so much but i'd rather do philosophy for an anime that i love and there's obviously some that i mean christianity is in it um I guess the dilemma of God is in season one. Religion is in season one. Uh, revenge is in season one. Those are main themes in season one. Season two, we we only have one episode, and I guess slavery is a theme. Um, being captured, no sense of free will, 
and the rat race, I guess you can call it, is in season one. What the f is in season two, my bad. Um, but yeah, that's really season two, episode one. And I'm really, I mean, with season one, season two will be beautiful, I'm sure. Uh, it can't disappoint, but we can't, I can't really say that for a fact because the promised Neverland was beautiful until season two got animated and then it just fell off for me. So I pray that they don't and uh, if they do ruin one of my favorite animes, but um, yeah, I just, I'd rather not like, uh, because I know it's going to be different, yeah, but the animation, the sort of way that I left you with, the sort of cliffhanger that I left you with, with Thorfinn, you know, not even being able to kill the person that he's been trying to get revenge on. So all of that, years, all of those years of his life, wasted. He wasn't even able to be Ascalad. He, he wasn't... There's a lot of philosophy in the first season, and I can't really talk about the philosophy of the second season just yet. But at least I've introduced to you as my audience that it's an anime that I know, and it's an anime that I've watched, and it is up for a philosophical talk and discussion so hope you're interested and i hope you are you know like excited for such or the rest of you know the 10 extra the 10 more episodes that are coming out for season is it 10 i think it's i think there's 24 episodes in season two or like 10 episodes something like that um it doesn't matter i'm gonna do all of them it's 23 extra videos like it's literally 23 free extra videos i can't pass such a beautiful deal um so yeah um hope to see in the next video whether it won't be another villain saga video but it won't be another villain saga season two recap or season two episode whatever i'm on recap but i hope to see in the next video and a special peace hope you enjoyed like subscribe comment share please don't forget to like and comment um for all of those who are watching welcome I, I i i suspect you may or may not be new but don't if you really enjoy my content then don't forget to like subscribe comment share you'll really be helping this channel out and encouraging me to push out better and better videos as time goes by and then eventually making you know even better videos at one point but as per usual peace